Hello, and welcome to RealPAR's Intermediate PLC course, CodeSys, Programming with POUs. This course is part of our CodeSys series, a series of courses packed with practical hands-on lessons about PLC programming using CodeSys. You can find the rest of the courses in the CodeSys series by searching for CodeSys on your RealPARS dashboard. All of the courses in this series are included in your RealPARS membership. In this course, you will learn how to build PLC projects using program organization units, also known as POUs. A POU is a container that encapsulates a piece of code and can be called one or more times in a project. POUs enable you to structure your projects in a logical way and to write modular code that can be reused in different applications. Programming with POUs is an essential skill for any professional PLC programmer, so it is important that you learn how to design, program, and test POUs. Lucky for you, that is exactly what we will cover in this course. In this course, you will learn about the different types of POUs that are available to use in CodeSys and build a project that utilizes each type of POU. By the end of the course, you will be comfortable with creating structured modular PLC projects using programs, functions, and function blocks. Upon completion, you will receive a certificate from RealPars. At that stage, you will also be ready to take more advanced programming courses about other aspects of CodeSys, like writing code using the other programming languages that are available in CodeSys, such as structured text, function block diagram, and sequential function chart. This is an intermediate course, which means that you should have some programming experience before following this course. If you are a complete beginner, then I strongly recommend that you follow our beginner CodeSys course before this one. In CodeSys 1, Introduction to PLC Programming, you can learn the basics of writing and testing applications in CodeSys using the built-in PLC simulator and a CodeSys compatible PLC. Following that course will give you the foundational knowledge that you need to follow this one. Now that you have an overview of the course, Let's take a closer look at the course curriculum and what exactly we will learn in programming with POUs. We'll do that in the next lesson. See you there!